I've come back this year and I brought my bodyguard with me. <laughs> this young man here needs no introduction, but I would like him now just to say a quick hello as he has something he wants to pass on to you. Thank you, David, for making your time available tonight. Yes, Thank you. Well, again this year, I apologize that my Samoa is no good. I need to sort of speak in English, or so I will try my best to make myself as clear as possible. We have approximately 18 minutes to share. Um, well, this is David's spot, but I'm just going to prompt and he's given me permission to ask any question I like. So I'm going to be really open. I'm going to share some of the things that I've heard people talk about. And we're going to dig straight into something that might be a little bit painful for some. But here's how I'm going to start. David, many of us are watching another boxer at the moment. His name is Joseph Parker. He has a trainer and a coach that you know quite well. Many of our Pacific people, when they watch that, are thinking, what is happening with Joseph? Why is he going with that same man that hurt our brother David to him? And I guess no one's really had an opportunity to ask you, David, how do you feel about watching Kevin do what he's doing? And what is your relationship like with him now? that uh, you've been through some tough times with them. What's your opinion now about Kevin Barry? So, maybe you see you on a that guy at the old family. On a on a on a young man that's a company of your car, on a young man that's a company of your car, on a Kamu faham itu, ayam ayam aku, oleh, aku pergi, faham faham, umah, ya, oleh, kurang asal jadi, kalau kita tak faham, 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 Ya, war waso ya wa, bayi mau kupu. Ya orang ini orang mana? Ya, kalau orang mana faham? Ia TV ya, ya ni mau kupu, umur soal fuisi. Ia mau faham fikir beli sesuai, oh bijak, luas full million. Kita lekang kefiok. Ia orang mana? Mafu faham, faham apa? Ia ya kiau. Ya musuh-musuh ingat awal dengan apa ia, ya fak mangalu, ya fak mangalu itu semua, ya fak ia ke awal ni mel, orang fufu ini mau mafu fufu apa dia, ok fak ia semele kalfengai, kau belia samua, kau belia ngayu makua, awal awal orang fufu malu pui-pui, ya awal ni ah kau siapa lah fang aku malu kau dua. So, mafu fau ngaya malang ngong ngah kupui fau ya kya. Ya kamu fai ya susu ya Joseph ya faf kai ya kuai lang kamu fai malang ngaya lang ngah kamu fai ngai kau kamu sih ya lu fau ya kuai ya kau lau lang faf moy moy bau lau bala lang ngong ngah ulo ya kya ya ulah kamu fai ya semer dari moy ya ong ngah ulo ulah kamu ngah dua makang aka fa pe di maske pula lai lumak. Orang faham kah, ngah orang kah koi lua, ia melo kup, ia ay, ia kya, ia bo, bo ia kya udah loko faham ngalo, faham mahungi, bo faham ngalo kui ia kya. Awesome, brother. Sorry to hit you with that hard one right at the start. That's my quick jab. So, what I'd like to talk about now is. You know, one of the things that really impressed me, when you were in your prime and we heard the news that you came home and you bought your mum and dad a house, that's the dream of most young uh, Samoan men is to support their parents. You became, for that season, rich, 
and famous. And we all admired what you were doing. Dave, you've been in that life. What warnings do you have for some of us here who still want to be rich and famous amongst us here? What's, what's the lessons you've learned from your life of being that rich and famous guy that we all used to admire on TV? Awesome. David, one of the things that men, all men, want is a sense of identity, a sense of I am someone. And you had identity. And to be honest, I remember watching you as a young man coming through. Your identity changed many times when I watched you being interviewed. You, one day you were Samoan, next day you were American. You know, there was a whole shift of identities. But how do you identify yourself now? When you think back on your younger years, what do you think is most important about your identity today? Because you are an older and wiser man. Huh? I'm a son of God. Yeah. <laughs> Ma fama yo olea, malea, malea, young fang alo ele, ele yo le tua fo ye vinga. Ye ye taula, ye lo wau, ma fo fo vai vai. O ke fa so ele ye, kawa fa mo mo le tua. Po o ame tu pu lo langa ne, o le tua mo elo tato so swan. Awesome. Beautiful. <clears throat> okay, so. We all have disappointments in life. And my question to you now is, is there some unfinished business in the back of your mind of the David tour of old? Is there something you've left undone? Is there anything that you regret that you think you may could have done better? Is there something there that uh, you feel maybe you need to finish something? Not that there is, but is there anything that sits in the back there that you feel uh, I, I have some regrets because we all do. Joseph. Uh, <laughs> Kwa <laughs> Yeah, 
Yang of Umar Alpha Missingonga. If I go fear, go kill kill or they cool. They cool younger. Or they cool younger poly cool, we cow. Or they cool, we cow like a cow. Keleko sang on my mouth from Singonga. I only cool lay. Kele le song on our moa mayaile, Fiku, Fiku Kosangale. I only le song a pico silling a cow. Or the cow there a coil of Wolanga. Peole, may pico silling anga, cow way a cap. I came in fast so sowing a yaw or ki Apollo. O we call him a sui yaku. You so. Fao or yoki say good oi, you song a lacu for ye may a cap. Yang a cool maua a cap le loaf or a coil of Wolanga. Ye farmer and allo. May ye for yes, may silly moa. Peole, ma'am. Awesome. That's great. David, um, on the news more recently, uh, the Kiwi culture is that there's so much domestic violence happening between husbands and wives and um, parents and children. And sometimes they tend to say, more recently they're saying the reason why Kiwis are very violent is because of the haka. Mm. Now, in my policing years, I would look at statistics and our Pacific Island people have a real issue with violence. Domestic violence, and not only just violent uh, abuse, but also the mental abuse. Huh? And I'll be honest with you. I've been in some meetings where I've seen some Samoan men look at their wives in the whanau and say, longuku, mm, longuku. And I'm thinking, oh my goodness, you know. Dave, there's, they try to connect haka with violence with our Pacific people. You know, we know that Boxing is a beautiful art. There's a big difference between training and fighting in the ring and then being violent in the home. Can you comment on that for us, please, David? Eo, e piko sili ang fain ka, o nga o kong wala maya, e faya ma e kalikali, e so so ako, ko iyako. E aro ka nga fuso lea, e e kela vea, e so uma. Eo, e. Ko nga ir kalalis ko, e nga fuso kang iya. Eo, e. Pe yo le, kulanga nga, e ya, e, e, e kia, wo umang ku umay yuma le kua, e ya kakou, le pao ay kong o kakou. Wo umang ku umay le kua, le, le, Le Kulanga <laughs> Fayonga Kako Kaofi Erika Payo Poisi, Alamem Fayasi, Alem Fayasi Yokimaku for Ego Kelefa Pea. What will look a fusu? I use Kua Ilanga or a meal for Sia Valang. Ya Mon Mawa Shot to do a lang for my Kua, what will be to silly on old Tamal Lake? Okay, come five for ye, Fayam Fakainga. Elenga ka kongolo wa inga iya so se meo ke alu yai. Na ila so nga mako kanwa i malesko inga iya nga alu la se uko lua e fakau. A wo fiu la so iya wo vala aula. Hello my darling. A wo fa perko inga lo kwa ku yai fa ku no no with her. A kongu ya kia u iya o le amela a ku wai upu le le ye ave mo iya 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 wa lo langa nge iya life is short. A kau nga ka ku Kako come for your face, our own and the lame Mogako, Kofa thing, Akako, a lofa, your caco, King Amo, Kako, Kofa thing, your cowfoy and caco, for your semen, lame Mogako, Kako Lua. Awesome. Okay, our time is quickly running out, but I want to ask you one question, and it's based on First Corinthians, where it talks about fight the good fight. So you have come from a boxing um, background, and there is a very, very similar discipline required to follow Jesus. So can you tell us a little bit about what values you've transferred across from boxing that will help you to stay on the straight and narrow in your pursuit for holiness and purity with God? <laughs> Ole ole a faile 
faila ka fusu anga faila fusu anga ya ile fa pe o le la faila fusu anga ro kanga ka os ka kam ka ukia ya pa wala o mea nga lo mo ya so uma e fa pe nga fo ila lo o langa a ile kala lei ele fa pe nga lo fa ya ku o ka ko ya yesu ya o ke de ka kalo o ke de fa ka ku spa ia o ke de fa ya fo i winga pe yo fa ka ku fa o yesu ya a ko ngu nge ke o ke le sa u fa am kalanga ya e pa o ale le me o le o ke ka fa ya so ma o ke ka lo de ku ya so so ngi ma yo ma ku vai vai and I came here on the Holy Holy Spirit. I also live in Alkanak. Please, Lord, help me not to get in my own way. Awesome. Well, David, on behalf of our brothers, I want to thank you so much for making your time available to come and share your heart. And I'm, I'm sure the brothers would agree with me, you don't often hear this side of David Tua. And he, I believe, wants to give glory to God. Our time is up. I want to give you the final word before we walk away from the stage. So. Yeah, first time, I have no. Yeah, I have no. Yeah, I have no. Yeah, I have no. Yeah. Eo fo te mi o le afa iwina ia amata lo ne viina lo ne viinga ia fa iwina lo ne viinga ia lo fo te le atu mo to uma le nei po fa fa te mo le afa no.